Well, Fred, my pal, we're sure having a great time here together. And the best part is, we have 19 more years to spend together. Where's a falling piano when you need one? Inmate number 2756, your conduct has been terrible in the past months. Well, what are you gonna do? Evict me? <laughs> well, apparently, yes. There's an upside and a downside to this. The upside is, I'm out of jail. The downside is, we won't be able to get to hang out now. That's the other upside. What? Nothing. The downside is, now I have nowhere to live. Hey, there's something in my pocket. Hiring, salary of 350,000 yearly, with a luxurious room and board provided. Oh, crud. Gee, has been 20 years already? Tony? Here for the job, I presume. I I'm, I'm leaving. I'm going. Wait! I know you don't have very good memories of this job. So you'll try to make my job less disturbing? No, you need the money, remember? You've been hired. Congrats. Great, now I can return to a life of delivering parcels to weird neighbors. Here you go. Gee, thanks. Yeah, I'll, I'll head to the first delivery then. Just like old times. Residence 362. All right, just this one over here. Okay, let's head in. Hello? Anyone home? I guess so. Hello? Wait, what the? What's your problem? Never seen a robot before? Uh. Humans are so insensitive sometimes. Is it just because I'm a robot I can't enjoy food? Uh, actually... Well, you're wrong. We have rights, too. I'll take that. Thank you. I mean, sure, sure, should I take it? Take it, it's yours after all. Uh, you don't look so well, buddy. Ah, I see you're back. Yeah, jeez. Thanks for your concern. By the way, I didn't know robots could own property. Well, you didn't know burgers counted as people either. Anyway... Here you go. You might also want to put this on. Another delivery in a mask? Oh jeez. A spider mask as well. What could this be? Residence 122 this time. With a very spidery looking outside. I can only imagine what this entails. Better put this mask on. Here goes nothing. Uh. Why, hello there, young man. I take it you're the exterminator? Uh, exterminator? I'm just the delivery guy. Oh, yes. Silly me. I did hope you were the exterminator, though. You see, we have the most annoying pest issues. Eek! It's it again! Our house is infested with those nasty humans. I am most terrified of these pests. Do me a favour, get rid of that pest. Human spray? Oh jeez. I'm sorry little guy. Oh. Thank you so much Mr Delivery Guy. I'll take this. Oh no, my mask. Don't spray me! I'm back. Why are you always so late? You've been gone for a week. I nearly died on the job. Whatever. This is coming out of your vacation time. Vacation time? Oh yeah, you don't have vacation time. LOL. Anyway. Your third delivery. Deliver this to residence number 121 and you'll get your month's salary. Wait, that that's it? Yep. Now go do your job. Well, something's gonna happen this time. Now, residence 121. Just at the end. Wait, hold on. Hello? This is a very weird house. It does remind me of a portal. No. 
It can't be a portal. I'm sure it's just an entrance to a house. Not a portal. Not a portal, I was telling myself. Oh, jeez. Uh... Hello? My friend, thank you so much. Wow, you must really like your lunch. Oh, silly me, I haven't told you. Our lab specializes in developing particle transmission technology. Or, in simpler words, we make portals! You just happen to be our 100th voluntary test subject. Voluntary? I haven't volunteered for anything! Sure you're a volunteer. You're an involuntary volunteer. Thanks for your help. Our portal is now almost ready for public use. Wait. Almost. Yeah, it still corrupts the DNA of whoever uses it. I guess I shouldn't have told you that. Please don't sue me. What the? Where am I? How do you feel, Fred? What happened? Your entire body's genetic information was destroyed. In other words, your body went haywire. Thanks to modern medicine, we can fix the rest of your body, which will be ready in about mm, two weeks. At least I got my month's salary of 30000 By the way, here's the medical bill. Wait, $200,000? Well, at least I won't have to deal with Frank anymore. Oh yeah, um, about that. <laughs> we have to find a body for you whilst yours was getting fixed up. Wait, what do you mean? Well, we have to implant your head somewhere else, and... What's the lump beside me? It's only a temporary arrangement, sir. Fred! What the...? Now we can hang out 24-7 for the next two weeks! 